Praise the name of Jesus Christ. Let us believe and pray. Therefore, I want to share the word of God shortly with you. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. I thank you for this moment. As I'm going to speak to your people, Lord, use me as a vessel towards their life. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray and believe. Amen. My friend, go straight to your book, the Bible. Open with me in the book of um, Matthew chapter 5, verses 11. The Bible says this, Blessed are, are you when people insult you, persecute you, and, and falsely say all kind of evil against you because of me. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Have you ever, ever been in a situation whereby people pick evil of you rather than speaking good of you just because you are serving God, just because you have dedicated yourself to God, just because you have decided to follow Jesus, just because you are following the footsteps of Jesus Christ. Remember that in this life, you have to face all, all circumstances which are bad. Many people say that, why is it that I'm facing all this trouble and yet I'm born again? But I come to tell you, keep on pressing on. Keep on standing with God because the fruit is coming. Praise the name of Jesus. The fruit will be seen. Some of you have been serving God here and there and people are abusing you. People are talking mainly evil about you. People are saying he, this and this because of you. Because of you serving God in reality. Because of you serving God in truth. I just want to tell you, my friend, in that office, maybe you have been abused. In that in that place where you are, maybe you have been abused. And maybe people are saying, oh, I know this system is pretending. Oh, no, this system is evil. This brother is evil. Just because you are serving God. Just because you are standing with the reality. Just because you are pushing the word of God. Just because you are following the right thing. Listen to me today. The word of God will not go void. You are serving God. There is a reward. You are serving God. There is the outcome is greater. Keep on pushing. Keep on running with God. Keep on standing with God. Remember that on the cross, someone was laughing. Can you remove yourself? Someone said, remember me. Today I said, God will remember you. God will remember you. In your problem, he will remember you. Stand with him. Keep on standing with Jesus. He will remember you. People are perse persecuting you. People are talking evil of you. Just because you are serving God. Remember. He will remember you. The time is coming whereby you will not be laughed again. Father, I pray for that person who have listened to me. Lord, may you open ways for them. Lord Jehovah, today, let their life change. Let your Holy Spirit be upon them. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. My friend, we are there and born again today. This is the time. I want to repeat this word after me. King of kings, I come before you. I am a sinner. This moment, forgive me. Write my name in the book of life. Renew me today. Lord, my focus is on you. Lord, stand with me. Remove my name in the book of darkness. Put my name in the book of light. Jehovah, thank you because you are wonderful. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Father, thank you for that person. Lord, may you heal them completely. Let them stand with you. Let them run with your word. Today, as they receive their salvation, Lord, do something new in their life. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. My friend, remember that if you stand with God, there is a reward. If you stand with God, there is a payment by the end of the day. Therefore, keep on moving with Christ. Keep on going with Christ because there is a reward. There is a reward coming upon your way. In Jesus' name, stay safe. In Jesus' shalom, peace of God, 
be upon you in Jesus' name.